Hey, what's going on, guys? It's Sue Tech, and it's uh, Tuesday, 4:23, and uh, today is supposed to be a momentous day. Today, basic attention token ads are supposed to go live. But first, I want to talk about this amazing news, also, and that's the Internet Archive receives $2,500 in basic attention token micro payments. So this is proof of adoption right here. This article on Ethereum World News by Jose Antonio Lanz. He talks about the Internet Archive uh, receiving $2,500 in tips. And last, and this is not even that long ago they did this. Last week we hooked up our cryptocurrency wallet to our Brave creator account. There's tiny micropayments that Brave users had tossed into the archives. Virtual tip jar had accumulated, growing more than 9K back, the equivalent of $2,500. So here you have proof. This is something that will give a lot of other websites motivation to, to um, sign up because they're definitely not getting this much from Google Ads or media.net or whatever else people uh, use they're definitely not getting that much from that and not only that but the user experience is easier because the ads are not there the regular ads, they're not there slowing down the websites, they're not there data mining. And so, I think you'll see a lot of people actually switch over to maybe adjust back depending on how much money they make. You know, you gotta think about it like this, right? If people start downloading Brave en masse, because we're we're talking about a browser that's constantly constantly increasing in uh downloads it's the trajectory is is basically forty five degrees up it's just keep going keeps going up so if people download the browser and they're blocking all these ads sooner or later there's gonna be a lot of sites that say, "Hey, these other ad networks are not really even paying me much." I'm just going to stick with Brave, with uh, Bat and Brave, and they're going to just remove ads in general, which will speed up their websites also. So they actually have faster websites because of that. Better user experience, and they'll just have to, um, they'll just have to tip or set up like a membership payment plan or whatever. <laughs> Excuse me, but this is an absolutely great sign because there's no other coins that are really making this kind of noise that are picking up this kind of adoption right now. So I hope this is updated soon, but the, the ad network is supposed to launch, which will just send this thing through the roof. And you can kind of see the market is breaking away from uniformly going up and down. Usually you see coins go up all at once. Everything is just going up. And now you see there's a differential in each one. One's going up, one's going down. Some are flat. There's steam's going down, factum's going up. Electronium's going up. I still don't know why I'm following this one, <laughs> but, um, and token pay is a joke. It's called joke and pay. $687 in volume, but basic attention token bat is really, I think it's going to be number one. I'm no number one or two. I mean, top five because the use case is so compelling. It's more compelling than everything else here. 
See, most of these other coins are trying to get people, are trying to force users. Whereas BAT, you don't have to force, force them to do anything. There's an incentive to use it. There's no incentive, not a practical incentive to use most of these other things. Steam there is, you know. But when you have to keep doing airdrops, keep, you know, sign up memberships like token pay or other things to keep people in, uh, uh, find ways to get people involved. That's how you know there's no really no real demand for something. So there's a real demand for a bat. It's a real demand. Anyway, guys, have a good one. Take care. Uh, please like and subscribe and download bat uh, and brave. All right, I put the link in the description box. Download it if you don't have it. And uh, get ready because this one's lifting off very soon. All right, peace.